the iPhone 16 Pro's bezels might be rather tiny. According to Weibo leaker Setsuna Digital, one of the most astounding technical aspects on the iPhone 16 Pro and iPhone 16 Pro Max might be their display borders. Setsuna believes that the iPhone 16 Pro's display will have a 1.2mm bezel, while the Pro Max's would have a small 1.15mm bezel. To highlight the difference, they state that the iPhone 15 Pro has 1.71mm bezels, whereas the iPhone 16 Pro's bezels are 30% smaller. These measurements seem to make the iPhone 16 Pro model's bezels the narrowest in the world, surpassing the Galaxy S24 Ultra's 1.5mm bezels. Perhaps the Galaxy S25, or more especially the Galaxy S25 Ultra, will break this record, but the iPhone will at least be able to maintain the title for a few months if this is correct. We were anticipating shrinking bezels from the iPhone 16 Pro due to prior rumors that Apple had ordered its suppliers to use the border reduction structure method, which compacts the copper wire underneath the screen. This technology is difficult to implement in large numbers, therefore only the Pro models will get it, not the standard iPhone 16 or iPhone 16 Plus. Shrinking the borders surrounding the next iPhone's display may not be as significant a change as other claimed enhancements, such as photographic improvements like a 48 megapixels ultrawide camera and bigger primary sensor, a new capture button, and a new CPU. However, reducing the width of the bezel results in greater display space in the same frame size. And, given that the iPhone 16 Pro models are expected to grow to 6.3 and 6.9 inches, thinner bezels will lower the amount of space required to expand the phone's bodies. Furthermore, we can't deny that it's fantastic for iPhone versus Android bragging rights. Our iPhone 16, iPhone 16 Pro, and iPhone 16 Pro Max rumor centers are the best places to stay up to date on next generation iPhone rumors ahead of its September release. But we have rumors about the news we should expect at WWDC 2024, which is next week, if you need more Apple announcements right now. Finally, what are your thoughts about it? So without being said let me know your thought in the comment below and if you are new here please subscribe peace out.